Hey guys, what is up? The boy Gerald here and welcome to another video. So in today's video, we will be having a look at one of the best armor sets in the game and how to get it already pretty early on. But before we are heading into the details, if you haven't already dropped a like, it would be really appreciated. And if you're new to the channel and want to stay up to date on the latest content of the latest games, make sure to subscribe. With this, you will help the channel out with reaching 250 subs by the end of 2020. So with that being said, let's get into it. So you can already get one of the best armor sets in Valhalla pretty early on in the game, being the Mentor's Outfit. And I have to say that this currently is one of my favorite armor sets in the game. And apart from that, if you're into making certain builds as well, this one is perfect for an awesome critical hit build. Also, the Mentor set looks really awesome fully upgraded, but also already looks really good when at the first or second upgrade. So in this video I want to show you guys how to get it, because even though this is a high level set found in high level areas, if you know where to go and what to look out for, you can get this awesome set in no time. Furthermore, you do not have to collect them in a specific order, so don't worry about that. So for the first part of the outfit, the Mentos ropes, you want to go to a church in a place called Guildford, which you can find right beneath the second S of Wessex on the map. And this one is pretty easy to collect. You just use the lift behind the church that pulls you up, shoot down the cargo in front of the window, enter the window and make your way down with a ladder and break through a floor to go down even further. And then find your way to the chest which contains the ropes. So with the first part of the set collected, go to the second location, this location on the map in Sussex, and make your way down into the ruins. Watch out though, because there are some enemies present, but you only have to take down one to get where you need to go safely. So afterwards, pick up the explosive barrel in front of you and follow this route. Slide underneath the wall here and throw the barrel at the wall to break it. So after breaking the wall, just follow the route which brings you to the chest containing the mentor's fan braces. And there you go, the second part of the mentor set. For the third part of the mentor set, the mentor's trousers, you have to go to Winchester in Hamptonshire. And this one can actually be a bit tricky to collect, because in order to enter the room with the chest, you have to shoot the bar door from an open window in the middle of the off-limits area. But after you have done that, you can enter the room and quickly collect the mentor's trousers and make your way to the mentor's cloak, which you can find north of the map along the river here in a camp. And this one can be quite tricky to get to as well, because you will need to get the key from an enemy in order to open the chest. But once you have collected the key, enter the small hut, open the chest and there you go, the mentor's cloak is all yours. And at last, in order to complete the entire set, you would want to collect the Mentor's Mask as well, which can be found in a small camp right above Repton. And here you can see it on the map, called the Sherwood Hideout. And this one is actually pretty easy to get. Just sneak your way into the building containing the chest and quickly make your way out of the camp again with the Mentor's Mask. And that's it. So there you have it. If you followed the guide, you have now collected the entire Mentor set and of course, you can upgrade it to Legendary, depending on your resources of course. But even on the Silver upgrade, this set is perfect for making awesome critical hit builds when combined with the right runes and weapons. When wearing all the pieces of the Mentor set, it gives you an insane boost to attack after critical hits which can stack up to 5 times for a duration of 35 seconds. And when wearing the entire set, there will be an increase of up to 20 attack together with some good increases to speed. However, since this member set is already pretty light, you will not directly notice much of this. So as I am power level 160 myself right now, I still have a long way to go. But I will be working on a critical hit damage and chance build in the upcoming days so stay tuned to the channel if you're interested in in-depth Assassin's Creed Valhalla build videos, very similar as the ones I did for Ghost of Tsushima. Also if you liked the video make sure to leave a like as this will definitely help the channel out and if you want to stay updated on the latest Assassin's Creed Valhalla content make sure to subscribe to the channel. I got a lot of Valhalla content coming your way from guides to walkthroughs and tips and tricks so stay tuned. Furthermore, through this you will not only support the channel but also help the channel in its goal of reaching 250 subs by the end of 2020. So this was it for today's video, so as always, thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one.